Please welcome Tatiana Ali. You recently celebrated your birthday, happy belated, <laughs> in January. <laughs> and you had a party, and Drake came. Drake. He did, he did. Have you, have you hooked up with, hit with him? Uh, he is absolutely brilliant, and I am a huge fan of his, and that, he, he, he okay, this club in LA, <laughs> Supper Club, Supper Club is like this amazing club, it's like a circus, and like, when they, when, People buy bottles of champagne. They like come out of the sky. A woman comes. Really? In, like a gymnast, and she comes down. Of the, and so I was just, you know, I'm not. I wasn't popping bottles like that. But he he got me a beautiful bottle of champagne, champagne. and it fell down from the sky, and I felt really special. That was a really nice story. But the question was, have you hooked up with him? I, the I think he's amazing. I think he's awesome. <laughs> You know, Tatiana recently admitted that one night stands are one of her favorite things. <laughs> yes, you did. Tatiana! This is going so bad. No, it's <laughs> not. No, you're amongst <laughs> friends. And can I just say, I saw what the haters said after you, but those women are being judgmental over something that they are too scared to admit. But here's I'm applauding you. No, but here's the thing. I, no, no, no. It was a, that was an article for the Huffington Post, and it was a question and answer. And they asked all sorts of questions, like, what would you, you know, what would you never do in front of anyone else? The most embarrassing thing. I was like, oh, I interpretive dance to Tori Amos. That's actually true. Okay. The one night stands thing, that's actually not true. Did you say it? I said it, yeah. But so I was true. tongue in cheek with like a lot of oh. the answers. I yeah. mean, I also said I cried three times a day because they asked how many times, like, when was the last time I cried? I don't know. Like, I cry all the time. But one night, the one night stands, it's not, it's not really true, but I was surprised. I mean, I was like 2013. I'm a grown woman, if that were the case, I this mean. This is all I'm saying. Now look, problem? now let me like... tell you something to the haters. Uh, there's nothing wrong with a one night stand. While I am married and all, you know, taken and everything, you know, I have lived as a woman. How do you think you get through things in order to be solid on the other side? You have to do stuff. So, <laughs> and, and look, look at me, Tatiana. If you're a responsible woman, with your own place and your own keys and you've got birth control. And by the way, you have got a very- Everyone's grown, everyone's consented. And didn't you graduate yes, from I Harvard? A, I did. Uh, hello. I did. <laughs> and she didn't have to go to college. Remember, she was very successful as a child actor. So if you wanna have a one night stand, just call us about it. <laughs> hey, Tatiana. Yes. There's something that I wanted to ask you, but the last time that you were here, we were just meeting, so now yeah. I feel like I can ask you what I really wanted to. Yeah. So back in 2011, do you remember when the Fresh Prince, um, was it 2011? No, that was way back in the day. That's like 1990. Yeah, I wanted to ask you about the hot <laughs> bed thing. But 2011 was the reunion oh, of yes, the Fresh yes, Prince yes. cast. And I noticed that Janet Hubbard wasn't there. Yes, Hubert. Janet Hubert, Hubert. Janet, Janet, Janet Hubert. Yes. She was the original Aunt Viv. Yes. And remember all the drama circulating with that, but we never really, hey, Will, how you doing? <laughs> <laughs> what a picture. Um, we never really got the story. What happened with the first Aunt Viv? Okay, well, the story from my point of view, remember I was a little girl. Yes. And so I spent a lot of my time in the classroom on set when I wasn't, when I wasn't on set. I guess. I was literally going to school. We in, know, a, in and a then you room. went to Harvard. Um, <laughs> But it, for, from, from my point of view, um, it was really like a divorce. Like when it actually happened, it felt like a divorce. And then, and Daphne Reed came in. She and was the new aunt Viv. She was the new aunt the nicer Viv, one. and it felt like we had to get to know like our new mom. I used to go horseback riding with Janet. She taught me how to ride horses. Aww. And um, but Did you there stay was... friends with her after, or did Will make you choose? No, Will didn't make any. I mean, no, 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 no. He yeah. never. He, he didn't make me choose at all. But yeah. but there was there was definitely like Tension. negativity. Like you could feel it, yeah. and I, which is amazing to me because like we were on a hit show and I, and yeah. we were everybody's making money and buying houses and and we really like loved each other and laughed every day. I don't see where why there would be tension or what what the issue would be. Thank you for clearing that like up that. for us. And. And again, thank you for coming by.
This is our friend Tatiana Ali. Isn't she the best? Okay, so the season finale of Second Generation Weigh-Ins airs tonight at 10.30 on BET.